George, I want to read a line from Pat Cipollone when he was in that contentious meeting uh, trying to explain to the president uh, and all the idiots that were around the table with him uh, why, why they couldn't do what the idiots wanted him to do. Uh, there is a way to contest elections that happens all the time. Uh, but the idea that the federal government could seize election machines, no. I don't understand why I even have to tell you that is a bad idea. George, the president, who Liz Cheney uh, correctly uh, reminded us at the end of the hearing, is not a child, not a toddler, even though he acts like a child and a toddler, behaved like a child, behaved like a toddler throughout this entire process. And uh, again, it went shopping for the craziest uh, maniacal ideas that he could find. That, absolutely. I mean, that's that's he has the emotional makeup of a three year old or a four year old. Um, but he is a 76 year old man and he is responsible for his actions. And in, what's quite remarkable is that this shouldn't have had one millisecond of discussion. And yet they took six, six hours. Of, it took six hours of screaming to mm -hmm. beat these ideas back. And then he goes right back at it. Two hours later, he's got to try something else, which is encouraging people to march on the Capitol.